Hallelujah. And they say the hole has disappeared. And I pray the God that healed to heal you tonight as well. Let the hole be covered in the name of Jesus. Be covered in the name of Jesus. Be covered in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Asante Baba. Thank you for feeling the emptiness. Asante kwa kujaza ule utupu. For you shall do an amazing things and you are doing an amazing things that the world shall know that you are God. Utenda maajabu watu wajue wewe ni Mungu. And all glory shall return to you from tukufu wote utakurejea. I pray that the destiny of this shall be spared from the enemy. Maisha mtoto huyu yaondolee katika mkono wa shetani. Be here. Pona. Be healed in the name of Jesus. Pona kwa jina la Yesu. Thank you Lord. Asante Bwana. Oh, hi. This is Mama Sharifa speaking. Uh, this is Sharifa, my baby girl. I gave birth to her two years back, only to come and realize that she had a hole in her heart, which costed her life so much. Sharifa has been spending her life in the hospital beds. She's been in the ICUs for months, speechless, very sick. We reached to a point that we were told she was supposed to go back to India because she was born in India so that they can go and operate her. It's been very rough for all of us, me as a mother, her as the sick, the sick one. But then we thank God, we praise the Lord, in Jesus' name, amen, because Sharifa is now okay. She was delivered here at CLJ Maranatha by Prophet Joel two months, I mean two weeks ago, and only to come to, uh, to the realization that yesterday went to the hospital, we did the, the echo, that's the heart. <laughs> it's very hard to say this, but then Sharifa is back to normal again. The doctors just told me and I witnessed it with my own two eyes. Sharifa is okay. The hole is nowhere to be found, nowhere to be seen. Thanks to God. I'm really happy. At least my baby won't have to go through all that pain again. There's no going to India. There's no going to nowhere. I'm very happy as a mother. Praise to the Lord. Amen. Thank you so much.